Yeah, you know, it was, uh, you know, typical process that, you know, you have to go through asking, you know, your, my former club uh, for permission uh, to speak uh, for an interview for the head coaching position. So, um, you know, I, I think deep down I was thinking maybe one would come, um, uh, but when it did, uh, you know, I was obviously, I was happy. Um, truthfully, I'd already been starting on a presentation. Uh, so uh, when it came through, I, it kind of just aligned with what I thought was, was going on and uh, just continue the process to get ready and be prepared for, for when the, the interview came. The fact that the roster in itself, there's, there's a lot of talented players on this roster. Um, and, and obviously having, you know, the information that, you know, Trevor uh, being the quarterback here, uh, he's won a lot of games in his time, and he's proven to be a successful quarterback. And, and those are things that are instrumental in, in, in being a winning organization, is, is having a quarterback who's proven to do it and also having talent. You know, So the team's shown to, to, to be able to do that, uh, no doubt. Um, but obviously the, the major thing is you know, uh, the market here and, and the love and uh, passion for this team. Uh, that's intriguing, I think, for anybody in, in, the, in the business. Is you, you, you put in a lot of hard work wherever you are, but uh, you know you, you want to see that it's, it's, uh, it's enjoyed for, for everybody who comes and supports it. So this is the top of the top of the table uh, in that regard in this league. The way that we see, you know, building a roster, um, the intangibles of, uh, you know, the importance of uh, the kind of player that, that we look for, um, and just uh, I think looking for a teammate in it you know not to say that every team doesn't doesn't have that between you know the position of head coach and, and GM um, but there's different philosophies and, and you know there's a there's a thousand ways to skin it you hear that all the time but I think the way that we see it and, and getting this accomplished um, I think it was fairly easy for us you know not even having that relationship truthfully prior to the to the interview um, how quickly we aligned and how we saw it um, I thought was a, a good uh, marriage so to speak for a partnership here. It's an honor, you know, I, and I understand uh, certainly, you know, what this team means to the to this province, um, and not set necessarily just, you know, the, the city of Regina. This is this is the full province. Um, so so it is truthfully, it's an honor to to be the the head coach of, of their football team. Um, and 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 at the end of the day, uh, you know, obviously everybody wants to be a champion, and we'll certainly work towards that. Um, but regardless, you know, game in, game out, uh, you know, I just want to make sure that we're putting out a product there that this province can be proud of. Yeah, you can expect passion, okay? You can expect uh, uh, certainly uh, a team, um, I think that that feels like family, you know what I mean? I, I know already prior to me coming here, you know, the riders have always been, you know, top in the leagues as far as being in the community. Um, but, you know, just my assessment of the people here in this province, um, tough, you work hard, and you love hard. Uh, the team's going to be the exact carbon copy of that, no doubt. Yeah, I think as a kid, you know, uh, I don't know if it was as cool to look at yourself as a coach. <laughs> you know, I was always looking at myself as a, as a professional football player. And, and uh, you know, being a kid from Canada sometimes, that's not the easiest things to do. Um, you know, but I, I had it in my mind very early that's something that I wanted to do and, and I really did whatever it took to attain that. And, uh, you know, certainly uh, my mindset doesn't change. Uh, you know, I just put different goals in mind and, and I'm not going to stop until it happens. So, uh, you know, as a young buck though, yeah, to say that I was going to be a head coach as a young kid, nah, I would have said that was boring. You know, I want to go out there and hit something. So that was a little bit cooler for me. But as I got older, my body fell apart. Yeah, yeah, head coach certainly now seems way cooler. Oh, this is this is right up at, at the top. I mean, there's there's uh, I've been very fortunate to be in this game for a very long time, and, and there's there's been many you know uh, accolades shared with uh, with my teammates or coworkers. Um, that are very special to me and my family, uh, but this this is right up there, man. Specifically in in, in this location too. So, uh, yeah, you know, someone asked me that yesterday, and yeah, the, the day wasn't even done, and I said, oh, I got to put it up there. The day's done yesterday. Now we're here today. It's, it's certainly right up there at the top.